so you guys have been asking for them the tour vlogs are back for the 1819 season we're just leaving the matchroom sport offices here in Brentwood we're on our way to Yushan in China for the Shang oh, I've got it wrong already this is never gonna happen run away to Yushan for the Yushan Shang Rao China 2018 Hong Rui Ma Cup Snooker World Open and that name was shortened we'll just call it the Yushan World Open for now but anyway we're gonna get a flight to Shanghai from Heathrow get a a bus over to the other side of Shanghai and then a bullet train up to uh, up to Yushan which is pretty cool so we've got a pretty long day ahead of us so uh, yeah a little few kips of the uh, journey for you guys coming up hours later, real long flight from Heathrow to Shanghai. Look who bumped into. All right, Maka. It's Mark Williams and we want to pay for the taxi, so we're going to try and get one now to uh, other side of Shanghai for the train, and then onwards to Yushan. Sweatiest, unhead conditioned taxi to get across Shanghai. Uh, we finally made it across Shanghai to uh, Hongzhou Railway Station. Um, we're going to get a train to Yushan. Um, it's now half eleven local time. We can't get a train until half past three. So, um, and this is what happens when you work for World Snooker. So, Mark Williams, Mark Allen, Lee Wolfe, Jamie Jones, etc., have turned up and they've left to. Uh, you left to the babysit their kit whilst they get a KFC. So, uh, cheers, lads. Thanks for that. Offices and it's just the final leg now of the journey. Not an hour to go. I think first they were all absolutely exhausted. So. After nearly 24 hours, playing the trains in automobiles, quite literally, uh, made it to Yushan. It's been a long, long, long day, and everyone's absolutely shattered. So, I'm gonna get inside and, uh, yeah.
stretches all the way down this main strip, it's kind of the main bar district to Yishan. And um, under this archway, I'll just poke it out now, is where the players are coming from. And uh, I'm going to try and get up here to get a better vantage point. now to the opening ceremony we can find our way through a labyrinth of, uh, of tables um, <laughs> coming to the end of day one um, been a minute it's very similar to what we usually do in China uh, usually the dignitaries a lot of the sponsors come down and uh, usually you're kind of some kind of massive break-off thing not really a massive most of the media are kind of over there so we managed to get a pretty decent <laughs> spot Done. 